Hey everyone, welcome to the channel, it's Arad and uh, in this video we're going to check into the 30th of June 2022 and uh, what the day will have uh, to offer to us or it has to offer to us and uh, with that said, should you be interested in a personal reading with me guys or uh, if you are interested into learning tarot with me uh, you can check out the description down below and uh, there you're going to see a link to my website where you can view all of these things. So with that said, uh, let's uh, make the cut and see what we have. All right. So the first card of the day, uh, that is going to be the death card. Moving on next, uh, we have uh, the two of uh, the two of ones, right? No, that's the five of ones. Oh, my God. It's just... <clears throat> they are so similar anyway so we do have the five of wands and uh, the final one uh, that's going to be the star there is no mistaking this one so the star card it is the third card the elemental dignity it's look like this no surprises today that is exactly how the day stands really it's uh it's that peculiar combination in between the uh, death card and the five of uh, wands which pretty much which pretty much speaks uh, for a natural well i will say ending although it's not exactly ending what i mean is this is going to be the natural finish it's not really an ending, but it is a finish of a phase. It's not a thing, it's a phase. Natural finish of a phase uh, into your work. Natural finish of a phase into your uh, private life, into your personal life, into your friendships as well. And there are going to be no shenanigans anymore. You basically, you, you won't be blindsided anymore in regards to the aspect these cards refer to so how do you know which aspects uh, those cards refer to well it's pretty much a a thing into your life whether a project whether a friendship like i said or a uh or a relationship which went through a lot of uh, surprising turnarounds okay it went through if you want to say it was a little bit volatile at some points if you want to say it was a little bit unpredictable as well but now things are normalizing they are kind of like settling okay and by doing so uh, this isn't because things changed by any means either from your side or from the side of your suitor suitor i'm sorry uh, or from your side and the side of your boss or the side of your client but it's just you are getting more accustomed to one another or you are getting more accustomed to the situation as well and what was surprising before what was unacceptable even if you will now it's it's completely okay it's completely within the framework and that will allow us to transition definitely transition into the next phase and let go of unnecessary if you want to say struggle but i would call it a hectic wavering the unpredictability scraping our nerves down it is because we cannot foresee what's going to happen the sudden surprising events the sudden uh, turnarounds and so on and so forth we, we, all that is pretty much over by the way guys it is a fantastic day that we are to um how can i put it into words to relinquish ourselves okay from uh, a habit which we are just time to time getting to for example if you are getting drunk time to time right or if you are smoking cigarettes time to time you are not a full-time smoker just a time to time today is the day where you know we can put our mental strength into that direction to just you know quit it for good uh, it, it's not something essential for us so why we should why we should do it if it doesn't make any sense if it doesn't make any contribution whatsoever that is just a side note i i am digressing a little bit okay but uh also uh, within the day we are going to and it's not even a boundary really but a uh irritating events irritate especially irritating people 
they're not going to irritate us anymore. And do you know why? Well, that is because for according to these cards, our paths are splitting away. We will have to deal with them no longer. Whether the project we work together is finishing or whether, you know, they are departuring into another town to live at, okay, or whether they have found a, a different social circle and they're not going to bother us anymore. It's just that that relief that it is coming this um, uh, this uh, Thursday, I was about to say Saturday, Thursday, that uh, we will allow us now to look more clearly to the future, which is the other elemental dignity here. Okay, uh, that one. This is the death card with uh, the star card. And although I would have preferred something different here, but then the, the other elemental dignity of uh, the death card and the five of wands would have been different. Okay. Um, <clears throat> what, what happened it is the plausibility, if that's even a word. What I mean is that now that this settling is happening, that we do have the foresight that we are now forewarned, if you will, now things becoming way more foreseeable and way more a plausible. If up until this point, you couldn't see how you are going to end up in a solid relationship. If up until this point, you couldn't see how you will survive at your working place. If at this point, you couldn't see a way out of a, um, a really tough argument with a friend and you thought that your friendship is pretty much lost. If you have, uh, if you couldn't see a way how to get through to your family, for example, well, those ways are now going to be sown or so. Yeah, well, they are going to be so. It is because with the death card and the star card, that, 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 is, that is like a window, okay? What is possible? And I will tell you what is possible with those two cards. What is possible, it's uh, <clears throat> a job of our dreams. What is possible, it is the unfolding love everybody is hoping for. What is possible, it is the friendship of support that everybody is striving for. What is possible, it is the peace and the lack of problem that everybody is trying to establish within a family environment. It is just what is possible. It is our ideals and our standards to come to fruition. But once again, that is going to happen only through, at least throughout that day. That is how we open up the window here. It's going to happen only through the transition. And one last thing I'm going to say before I wrap this thing around here. It is that the transition is important it is because there will be that affinity, especially into people that have a lot into their chart, astrological chart. I'm not an astrologer, but that could happen, which they just cannot let go. OK, uh, for example, you are in that argument I just spoke about and you just can't let go of it. You know, it, it's bad for you, but you just can't help yourself to harp about it and to be involved in it and so on and so forth. I mean, that person is leaving and yet you are still seeking the confrontation. Maybe because you want to prove a point, you know, maybe because uh, you don't want to be trumped, but it doesn't matter. That's the thing. It's the phase is over and it's time for you, for me and for anyone who watches this video just move along or rather like a move on and don't forget guys it's the natural finish so whatever wants to walk away let it be because it serves no purpose whatsoever that is the very core of the death car okay it serves no purpose we don't need it and it's only gonna be a, a dead weight for us if we try to borrow its time and so with that said, uh, this is the uh, daily uh, guidance for the 30th of June, 2022nd. Uh, hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like the guys and we're going to see each other uh, next time. Until then, bye.